Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. Before I begin, I would just like to thank everyone who has liked, shared, and subscribed to my channel. I would also like to thank those who have purchased a reading with me and to all of those who have commented on my videos. Um, I don't have time to answer everyone, but I do read each and every comment, so thank you so much. This reading is for the sign of Cancer for the month of July going forward or from the time that you view this video going forward and these energies can play out to as much as six months. For you Cancer, as an overall energy, we have the Moon. The Moon is about hidden things, uh, a need to take a deeper look at uh, things going on around you, a deeper look at contracts, um, I feel strongly for some of you this has to do with a contract. Um, this can also indicate possible deception. You could be feeling more psychic at this time also with the moon here. Uh, there are things going on behind the scenes, things that you don't know yet. Under that card, uh, we have the Magician. So there's something that you are trying to manifest, but you do not have all the facts yet. Uh, the picture is just not clear. And so I feel that with the moon here, that there is a delay to this. At the bottom of the mini Rider Waite deck, we have the Four of Cups showing that you are not happy at having to wait for something, uh, most likely whatever it is that you wish to manifest. Um, this could be with regards to money because I do have the Four of Coins here and that would indicate you uh, sitting tight. Not to say that you're poor, it's just that you are holding tightly to your finances um, hoping that things are going to get better. Uh, with regards to relationships, you could be holding on to uh, someone for fear of losing them. So you're holding on very tightly. There's going to be a message, um, possibly, this is from someone that you know, so there is a message coming in. This could be with regards to work. Uh, or with regards to a relationship. And this news could be uh, what you are not happy about also because it sits right in between this Four of Cups and this Four of Coins here. At the center of this reading, we have the Judgment card. As clarifiers, I drew another judgment card and temperance. So for some of you, you could be making a judgment call with regards to someone or something. Um, I feel that the main message here is with regards to your emotional well-being, I feel that you need to bring balance uh, back to these emotions, uh, back to your emotions. I feel that there is healing that is needed for something that has happened in your past. There's something that you wanted to manifest and this could be with regards to um, relationships, but I feel that, I feel here we're, we're speaking about finances, we're speaking about security. Um, I feel that in the past you had some success with, uh, with your finances. But something, something happened 
Um, there's a lot of confusion and lack of clarity here uh, in the past with regards to finances, possibly with regards to your work, your job. Um, and I feel that a lot of this, um, whatever's going on with your finances is affecting your emotional well-being here. Perhaps you had a lot of choices in the past. Not all of them were good. Uh, perhaps you made a wrong choice. I feel that I have again cards about healing and you praying for answers, uh, wanting to move forward, wanting to manifest your security, um, having to be patient. And I feel that I feel that this is surrounding a wish. Although I don't do not have the wish card here, but I feel that this is with regards to a wish. And you know, I drew the four of swords on the four of swords it was the first clarifier to come out. And then with with uh, judgment that brings healing and temperance also speaks to healing. Uh, something happened in the past with regards to your finances. You have a wish. You wish, and this is with regards to your security. And you are having to heal or trying to heal from whatever happened. You're, you're trying to move away from this uh, challenging energy and you will. You want this new beginning. This is evident. I see it throughout the uh, reading. You feel as though you have um, you've done all you could and now you, it's like you're, you're waiting. Uh, I, I feel that you don't even know your own potential. It's possible that you could Either you have an addiction or you are dealing with someone who has some type of addiction. Um, there is the possibility for some of you of uh, money coming your way. I feel that your finances are not balanced and I feel with regards to finances this is what, what is causing this emotional imbalance here. Uh, there is light that will be shed on this, uh, on this situation. I think that you have uh, been doing a lot of reflecting evident with the um, Hermit here and the Four of Swords here. Reflecting, healing. Um, you see here you wanted to move forward and here in your outcome you will be moving forward this is what you are trying to manifest and you will be able to uh, to get that um, you feel that um, you feel that there's some sort of deception perhaps with regards to money perhaps with regards to your work or your 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 boss um, you feel you feel conned in some way um, something something is going to happen that's going to propel you forward and set you on to a new path here And I feel that whatever whatever has been hidden from you 
light is going to be shed on that. It's going to be revealed. So now, if you have a question, I would like you to think about it while I shuffle the Angel Answers cards, and uh, we'll try and get an answer for you. If you believe, what a nice card. Talk about manifesting. If you believe, you can make it happen. I'm going to get the uh, full definition for you. What you need right now is faith. You can have what you desire but you must believe that it can be so. Stay positive and visualize the outcome that you're hoping for. Set aside all negativity or pessimism in favor of a sunny outlook. The law of attraction brings to us what we expect to receive. So if our perception is that we deserve great things, then we will attract happiness. If we fall into doubt and don't believe in our own self-worth, then our experiences are going to match that energy. So believe in yourself and in your cherished dreams. So I do hope that that has answered your question. It certainly fits this reading. I thank you so much for watching. If you would like to book a reading with me, the details on how to do so are in the description box below. Many blessings to you, Cancer. Bye for now.